The Wild West is descending on Allstate Arena. The Professional Bull Riding Championship comes to town, and Ross Barron is there live on a bull with a preview. You hopping on? I'm on, Mark. I am on. This is Pile Driver. He's about 16, 1700 pounds, and he's behaving very well. I am not going to pet him because I am not the bull whisperer. But we've got lots of exciting things happening here, including rodeo, bull riding. We'll tell you all about it. We'll introduce you to some of the riders after we take a look at what else is happening in today's weekender. And I get off this bull. <laughs> Start planning that summer vacation now at the Chicago Travel and Adventure Show. It's Saturday and Sunday at the Stevens Convention Center in Rosemont. Explore vacation options to more than 250 destinations around the world. You can attend travel seminars, meet travel celebrities. You can even ride a camel or take scuba lessons in their dive pool. For a good laugh, check out the Chicago Sketch Comedy Festival. It's going on now at Stage 773, the largest festival of its kind in the world. There'll be 180 groups from around the globe performing nearly 200 shows over eight days. Performances will take place in each of Stage 773's performance spaces through January 20th. If you haven't been to the American Writers Museum yet, and it's been open about a year and a half now, this is a great time to swing by after the holidays when things are slow. Plus, they've got a great exhibit called Bob Dylan Electric. It features all kinds of memorabilia, handwritten lyrics, a lot of things that celebrate Dylan not only as a musician, but also for his works in literature. It'll be here through April 30th. On the museum beat, you still have time to see stories of survival at the Illinois Holocaust Museum and Education Center in Skokie. This world premiere exhibition features more than 60 personal artifacts brought to America by survivors of the Holocaust and other genocides never before on display. Stories of Survival runs through Sunday. And on the theater beat, The Lightning Thief, the Percy Jackson musical, is in performance at the Oriental Theater. Based on the best-selling novel, it's the story of a son of Poseidon who has newly discovered powers he can't control, monsters on his trail, and is on an epic quest to find Zeus's lightning bolt to prevent a war between the gods. It runs through Sunday. Okay, full disclosure, I have to introduce you to Dakota Butter, who is the professional bull rider, and he was standing right here helping me get on and off pile driver, so I felt very, very safe. But tell us a little bit about the event this weekend. Uh, here in Chicago, we'll have the top 35 bull riders in the world, and we'll have the best bulls here. Pile driver is one, one of the best bulls in the world, so it'll be good watching. How long have you been doing this? This is my third year on tour, and I've been riding big bulls since I was 16. I'm 26 now. What made you decide you wanted to do this? Riding a bull, that's kind of scary. I grew up in rodeo. My dad rode, and I, my family was always involved in rodeo, so I just grew up with it, and it's something I've always wanted to do. Yeah, we're looking at you over here on this video, and uh, I, I, <laughs> don't try this at home. But I guess in the Midwest here, specifically in Chicago, big, big increase in uh, Western sports. Yeah, the, the PBR is growing. The fan base is getting pretty big. We're getting watched all across the country, everywhere, really, around the world, and it's getting pretty popular. So you're just starting the tour now, right? Yeah, this is our second event of the year. All right, I want to talk a little bit about uh, the rodeo that has been added to this event because we've got Jackie Crawford over here. Come step this way so we can take a look at her. And, and she's doing some practicing here, some rodeo. So tell us a little bit about that. So at the rodeo, it's not just bull riding. There's other events too. There's bareback riding, bronc riding, Jackie's in the breakaway roping. There's team roping, barrel racing. So instead of just bull riding, you get all events of rodeo. And I guess this is the first time, this is a million dollar prize for this, right? Yeah, this is a big deal. <laughs> this a big is a deal. big event for the rodeo people. Yeah, so you, we expect a lot of folks coming out here over the next couple of days. Why don't you take a step back here? She's really good at what she does. She's actually, Jackie is from Springfield, so she's local, so that's really cool. So folks can come tonight, tomorrow, uh, Sunday. Yeah, you bet. She starts at 7 tonight, and then 6.45 Saturday, and 1.45 on Sunday. All right, Dakota, thanks, and good luck. Thanks. So there you have it, crossing that one off the list. Back to you in the studio, Stacy and Mark. I, I was a little nervous. I got to say, I was a little nervous. I'm just so glad you are safe, Roz, because I've <laughs> been to those rodeos, and I've seen how violent it could even actually get in the cage. So the fact that you're off there and you're good to go, glad to see it. Yeah, Stacy was very impressed. I can also vouch for that, for sure. <laughs> yeah, well. My weekend starts now. Yeah, yeah. there you go. Well done, Roz. Thanks Thank so you, much. Thank you, cowgirl. <laughs> Appreciate it.